Make a wish. Hey, happy birthday. What's your soulmate's name so daddy can take care of him? Dad. I'm kidding. Come on. His name hasn't even shown up yet. Okay, but when it shows up, you tell me who it is. Understand? No, please. I'm telling you. I, I don't know nothing. Oh. Maria, put your headphones on. Hey, Maria. Yeah? I finally did it, sweetheart. I got his location. And by his, do you mean the man that killed... Your mother. Yeah. Turns out he's got a secret son. You're kidding. Nah, he's a CEO of a company. Let me guess. You want me to use him to get to his father? Yep. I already got a plan. What's his name? Antonio. Antonio Stefano. <sighs> what? What's wrong? Nothing. Nothing's wrong. Just thought I saw a bug. Tell me what you need me to do. And pretend you got a big business deal for him. Okay, but what if he's not interested? Then you make him interested. For mom, I'll do whatever it takes. He's ready for you. Mr. Stefano, Miss Lane is here. Nice to meet you, Mr. Stefano. Please, call me Antonio. Take a seat. I hear you have a business proposal for me. Actually, I do. May I show it to you? Go right ahead. And that's how this deal will make us millions. That's amazing. Unfortunately, I'm not looking to make any deals right now. Then why did you have me explain it? I like the sound of your voice. Now, why don't you do me a favor, doll, and tell me why you're really here? I'm afraid I don't know what you're talking about. Don't lie to me, Miss Lane, if that's even your real last name. What are you implying? Let's just say I have a lot of enemies. And you think that one of them sent me to what? Kill you? Maybe. Maybe not. But one thing's for sure. Your little business deal was bullshit. What makes you say that? Some of the math was off. By a lot. Look, I don't know who you think Mr. I... Mr. Stefano, your father's on the phone. <sighs> Stay here. We are not done. Excuse me. Dad, did you get all that? Yeah, the son of a gun's smarter than I thought. Yeah, maybe double check your math next time. Look, you gotta get out of there. I can't. He... He's coming back. Now where were we? You were just about to let me go home. Not gonna happen, Miss Lane. Not until you tell me what's really going on here. Fine. First off, don't call me Miss Lane anymore. My name's Maria. And secondly, this conversation hasn't been private. Maria, what the hell are you doing? But now it is. Who was listening in? If you want to know that, I suggest you sit down and listen very carefully. So we're soulmates. And your father doesn't want us to be together? Yes, but I'm done listening to him. I... I want to be with you. Maria, what the hell was that about, huh? Relax, he's got a thing for me. And I put a tracker on him. I gotta say I'm impressed. We're finally gonna get justice for your mother. I see his car. He's here. Copy that. Hey, you came. Of course. <laughs> I'm ready to run away with you. Me too. I say we leave and never come back here again. Cheers. To new beginnings. So, whose car are we gonna take? <laughs> Let's, Let's take, take mine. mine. No thanks. Actually. I don't know if you guys remember, but a while ago, I had wispy bangs. My intrusive thoughts are getting to me right now, and I kind of want them back. So come with me to cut my hair and potentially fuck it up. I'm going to do very small sections because you can always cut more hair off. Unfortunately, you cannot put it back. This feels like too much, even though it's like four strands of hair. Okay, I think this is good. <laughs> you know what? We don't have time to be a baby. I'm going to cut it short first. Oh! <laughs> I already like it, it's not even short enough, but it's cute. I almost forgot to film myself cutting more. Okay, I hope that wasn't too much. That would have been a little short. No way, actually, I'm crying. It's not that bad, right? Okay, I think I'm just dramatic. <laughs> I mean, it's fine. Honestly, I should have left them long. Next video is going to be me selling this hair on eBay so that I can buy a wig to cover this. Please be a long time. I really want to stare at Josh in fourth period. What? What am I supposed to do if I can't see the whole day? Hey, what do you think of this shirt I'm wearing? Uh, nothing, since I only got four minutes to see today. Um, Bailey, I'm to your right. Oh. Am I going to have to drive to school today? No, bitch. I'll drive. You can't see. Right. <laughs> um, you're in my seat. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't know. You're not even looking at me. Shouldn't you check before you sit down? I literally can't see anything. Well then, feel around or something, I don't know. Damn. 
Don't worry, Stacy. This will teach her. Who did that? Y'all are assholes. She did not deserve that. Thank you. I'm over here. Sorry. Oh, wow. <clears throat> uh, you're really beautiful. One? How can well, you? Well, at least he's popular. Honey, are you alright? Yeah, I'm okay. Okay, just checking. I love you. I love you too, Mom. I know it's been hard, but try to have a good day, okay? I will. I know you guys tell me to stop messing with my hair, but my bangs need a trim. Am I gonna go to a stylist? No. I'm gonna cut them myself with my baby tiny scissors. I just wanna do some baby pieces in the front because I don't trust myself, but I also can't see because of the bangs. Okay, I'm just gonna say fuck it and start cutting. <laughs> I don't wanna mess them up. That's my biggest worry that they're just gonna like look really bad. I don't think that that's even. I think I need to cut a little bit more on this side. Hopefully I won't regret this. Okay, I'm too scared and I barely took anything off, but I can definitely see now, which is good. I think that they're cute. My hair is always really messy, so you probably won't even tell if they're kind of uneven. Okay guys, I just got back from the festival day two and my hair is looking a little crazy, but the makeup has stayed on for the entire duration of the festival because of this NYX Cosmetics mattifying setting spray. It is so impressive and look at these stars. The dating standards in 2023 are literally on the floor. Like when did a date become getting in a car and just sitting in the parking lot? I just want someone to serenade me. Is that too much to ask? If you agree that romance is dead, then you're gonna like this song. I keep denying Look at this dude I'm talking to. He is so fine. Oh, uh, what happened to the dude you were talking to last week? Yeah, I blocked him on like everything. What do you mean you blocked him? I asked him what he was doing and he said he was going to the gym, like J-I-M. You blocked him because he said a single word that you did not like. Yes, what else was I supposed to do? That was the worst thing I've ever heard. Okay. <laughs> Get ready with me as I tell you guys about the time I had a stalker. When I first moved to LA, I lived in an apartment complex that had a gym with it. But then I moved to somewhere that had no amenities at all. So I had to go and get a different gym membership. Since my rent had gone up, I was like, um, bitch, I'm gonna save some money and go to Planet Fitness. Key piece of information, this was not in the best area at all. Everything had been totally fine, no weird experiences, until this one day I smiled at a dude in the parking lot and then he left a note on my windshield. I was just trying to be friendly because he was getting out of the car right next to me, but oops. the note basically said, you're cute, call me, and I kind of laughed at it and never did because it's weird. Fast forward two months, I had gotten a new car and it was like 9 p.m. I come out of the gym and there is a sticky note pasted right above my door handle. This is what the note said. Mm. Obviously someone was butthurt that I didn't text them. This man knew what my old car looked like, now knew what my new car looked like, and knew what time I went to the gym. I went back the next day and canceled it immediately, but they couldn't do anything about it. I know you guys tell me to stop messing with my hair, but my bangs need a trim. Am I gonna go to a stylist? No. I'm gonna cut them myself with my baby tiny scissors. I just wanna do some baby pieces in the front because I don't trust myself, but I also can't see because of the bangs. Okay, I'm just gonna say fuck it and start cutting. <laughs> I don't want to mess them up. That's my biggest worry that they're just gonna like look really bad. I don't think that that's even. I think I need to cut a little bit more on this side. Hopefully I won't <laughs> regret this. Okay, I'm too scared and I barely took anything off, but I can definitely see now, which is good. I think that they're cute. My hair is always really messy, so you probably won't even tell if they're kind of uneven. Okay guys, I just got back from the festival day two and my hair is looking a little crazy, but the makeup has stayed on for the entire duration of the festival because of this NYX Cosmetics mattifying setting spray. It is so impressive and look at these stars. Come on, give me an X. Oh no, no, no. I cannot be a hider. My whole family are seekers. Concealer, please don't fail me now. Okay, let's see your mark. <gasps> yes, I knew Our it. Our girl is a seeker. Now we can finally tell you how the game works. So of course there's hiders and there's seekers, but everyone wants to be a seeker. The hiders are given a certain amount of time to hide and then we get to go find them. When you find the hiders, do you... No, honey. <sighs> okay. We knock them out and then we trade them in for money. What? 
If you turn in a family member that's a hider, you get a million. Well, I mean, that's kind of stupid because family members, they are worth a lot more than money, right? I'd turn your butt in in five seconds. <laughs> <laughs> Honey. What? You're sweating. No. You okay? Um, no, I actually think that I might be bleeding, so I'm gonna go wash my face. I'll be right back. Oh shit, I knew it, the makeup came off. What the? Ellie. No, you're a hider. I can explain. You little liar, I'm telling mom and dad. Kim's a hider. What? What? She faked her mark. I'm sorry. Why would you do that? Because I, I was scared. Attention, the game has begun. All hiders now have two hours to find a hiding spot. Go hide. No. You have to. Just don't let us find you. But hide now, damn it. Get out of here. This is my spot. I don't know where to hide. All the flights are booked and all the buses are filled. What am I going to do? <laughs> Shh. Listen, you're about to get caught. Hey, I said you're about to get caught. Come on, let's go. You're a seeker. You're trying to trick me. This mark is fake. If I were a real seeker, you'd be knocked out by now. Just play along. What? Shh, don't say anything. Well, well, what do we have here? You caught a hider, huh? Yeah, she was a hard one to find, but I finally caught her. We were just leaving, actually. Nah, she's not going anywhere. Don't touch her! Um, are hiders allowed to fight back? No, not really. Run! Oh, shit. Quick, in there! Whoa, wait, what is that? An underground tunnel I made. Now, come on! I am not going down there. I don't even know if I can really trust you. I've gotten you this far, haven't I? We have to go now. We'll be safe down here. Why are you helping me? Because you... Who gave you that necklace? My sister. Get rid of that necklace. Your sister is tracking you. No, she... she wouldn't. Oh, yes, she would. We need to keep moving. No. Excuse me? Yeah, I want to know why you came out of nowhere like, like some ninja and saved me, but you don't even know me. It's because you remind me of my sister who got traded in by my family. They traded in your sister for a million dollars? Yeah, and from then on, I've been trying to protect all the hiders I can. What was that? They found my tunnel. I'll distract them. You run. Yes, you are. I'm not losing another girl on my watch. Now go! <laughs> Ellie, found you. You're it. Oh. Sorry, sis. That necklace led me right to you. Time to get my million. Nighty night, Kim. Time to get my money. Where am I? And what am I wearing? We're in Hyder Prison, and that's our uniform. They think we're related, really? I mean, we do kind of look alike, I guess. You remind me of my sister, who got traded in by my family. Do you have a brother that's a Hyder? Yeah, why? Because I think I know him. He tried to save me, but my sister turned me in. He is so worried about you. There has to be some way out of here. After you get caught, you have the option to end the game, but if you do, you die. Someone has to sacrifice themselves to save everyone else. That's why no one ends the game. I'll do it. My whole family turned against me, so I really have nothing, and you deserve to be with your brother. No. Want to end the game? It'll be okay. No, please. Congratulations, your bravery has made you leader. Our marks are gone. You pick the next game. Hey, table five needs a refill on their wine. Okay, I'll do it in one sec. Here's another drink for you guys. Is there anything else I can get you? No, but you seem like a beautiful soul. Have a Merry Christmas. Thanks. Someone left a gift for you on the to-go counter. A gift? Maybe it's from one of my regulars. You're so lucky. I wish I'd get a gift. You are the most beautiful girl I've ever seen. Enjoy the makeup, Secret Santa. I don't know anyone who would have given me an anonymous gift. The mystery is part of the fun. Enjoy it. <laughs> Oh, uh, hey, Bailey. I am not taking table four. They smell like broccoli and B.O. No, there's another gift for you. Oh, here's something to remind you of me. Secret Santa. You have to find out who's been leaving me these. Excuse me, ladies. Everyone keep taking breaths. Get as much air as you can. I'm trying. 
Why are they gonna limit our breaths anyway? This is stupid. We're running out of oxygen, so this was their solution, I guess. <sighs> Why aren't you taking any breaths? I am. <sighs> they just sent them out. I got a million. What? How many did you get? I only got four. Close your mouth right now. Don't waste any of your air. You need to hold your breath for as long as you physically can today, okay? Do you not have any breaths? You look like a chipmunk. Wait, like none at all? You need to be careful. You're gonna die. Are you okay? You look a little pale. Are you sure? Because you don't look very good. Oh my god, are you okay? Oh no. Can someone give her more breaths? She only has two left. I can do it. I have a lot of them. Then do it. She needs them now. I just did. Thank you. Whoever distributes the breaths must really not like you. What? Hey, what do you think you're doing? Uh, uh, nothing. You are a terrible liar. You know you can't go outside until you turn 21. But why? I'm 18. Isn't that close enough? No, you're not going outside. I need to know what's out there. I'm going to work. Don't try anything while I'm gone. Okay, see you later. Why is there nothing good on Netflix right now? Who's there? That's definitely not my mom. Bailey, honey, listen to me. There's somebody inside the house. I saw it on the cameras. You have to leave now. But I can't go outside. It's just this one time. The police are on the way to save you right now. What do you mean they'll save me? Okay, this is it. I'm going out the window. Wow. <coughs> a million dollars or a hair clip? Come on. Whoops, sorry. Phoebe, do you know what you just made me do? I didn't mean to. Mom says it's your turn to take out the trash. No, she didn't. She said it was your turn five minutes ago. Hey, wait. How do you know that? You weren't there. Uh, I don't know. I just, I just do, okay? I don't think I can make it to your party. What? Why not? You always come to my party. Sorry, but my mom's not letting me go. You sure that's the real reason why? Uh, yeah. Anyways, I gotta get to calculus. Hey, I think this clip is telling me the truth about people. You ready for a date, babe? Yeah, I'm so sorry. I don't think I'm gonna make it. What? Why? Something came up at work and it's urgent. Quite hey, so. you work at a you computer factory. How urgent can it be? I'll explain later. Don't worry. I gotta go. So all this time he's been lying to me about his job. I have to follow him. Did you get the codes? Yes, sir. I have them on my phone. And you're sure you weren't followed? Not that I know of. Excellent. Because I have another job for you. Hey, who the hell are you? Um, I'm... That's it. Get over here. <sighs> hey, boss. Look who I fell spying so. on us. You no, I, I wasn't spying on you guys, I swear. Who do you work for? Who sends you? No, nobody. Hey, stop. She's with me. Do you know this girl? Yeah, I do. She's... She's my girlfriend. Jack, I am so sorry that I followed you. I don't have any wires on me or- Quiet. I told you. No attachments, Jack. She was just a cover, sir. Good. Then you shouldn't have any problem with me getting rid of her. Sorry, sweetheart. But I can't have you running away and crying to the cops. You're not gonna shoot me. Why is that? Because... You can't. You have no idea what I'm capable of. What? It's jammed. Okay, both of you drop your weapons now. Really, Jack? You're gonna turn against me, huh? Sorry, sir. Can't let you kill it. Now slide those weapons over to me. Alright, let's go. You've gotta regret this. So when were you gonna tell me that you're a criminal? How did you know his gun was jammed? No, I asked you first. Answer me. Listen, there's no time to explain. We have to change our appearance. They're gonna come looking for us soon. Take this cash. You're gonna run to that store quick and go buy us new clothes. Okay, and what are you gonna do? I'm gonna stay here and keep an eye out for anyone looking suspicious. Okay, fine. I really like your hair clip. Thank you. Are you here all by yourself? What happened? There was a woman in there who was acting really suspicious. I think they're on to us. We, we need to get out of here now. Okay, get in. Jack, this is in our car. I know, now let's go. I still can't believe you hotwired someone's car. I had to. My boss knows my license plate. He could attract us. I just hope this hair clip still works if I'm not wearing it in my hair. Huh? Look, this is going to sound kind of crazy, but... Which hair clip is magic? 
it tells me the truth about people. It's how I knew your boss's gun was jammed, and it's why I followed you to work. You're joking, right? No, and honestly, it's really been coming in handy, so what's wrong? My boss. He's here. Well, what do we do? He's headed right towards us. Follow me. I think we lost him. Yeah, for now. Jack, I can't keep doing this, okay? We've been on the run all night. I'm tired. I think I know a place where we can crash for the night. Hey, I just want to say I'm sorry for all this. You broke my trust, Jack. I know, and I'm going to do everything I can to gain it back. I promise I'll fix this. Now get some sleep. We'll talk more about this magic hair clip in the morning. Okay. Jack. Looking for Jack. You really thought you could get away from us? Where is he? He won't be able to save you this time. Get over there. I want to make a deal with you. You come work for me, and in return, I'll let Jack go free. I don't think I can trust you guys. It's not really your choice. Unless you want to see your boyfriend dead. You're not going to kill Jack because you're his parents. What? How did you... How does she know that? I don't know. She... She must be a spy. Yeah, I kind of realize that now. Who are you talking to? She's obviously talking to someone on comms. No, I'm not talking to anyone, I swear. I bet her hair clip is a camera. No. No, wait. Give that back. Quiet. There's no camera or microphone, but it is a cute hair clip. No. What the? This thing just spoke to me. What did it say? It said she's feeling worried. How could the hair clip know that she's nervous? You know, I've heard about things like this. I think this hair clip might be magic. Oh, come on. Don't be ridiculous. No, it all makes sense now. That's how she knew my gun was jammed. And how she knew to avoid me at the store. Make this thing tell us the code to the... It doesn't work like that. Sure it does. You're just holding out on us. You make this clip tell us everything we want to know, or else we're gonna... Hey, that's enough. Did you just... No, don't worry. They were just trank darts. Now let's get you free. I believe this belongs to you. Thanks. So, you have to turn my family and I in. What? Jack, I'm not going to turn you in. I. It's okay. I'm sure your parents have reported you missing by now. It was going to happen to me eventually, so just make the call. I'm going to find a way to bail you out, okay? I can't believe I'm using my birthday money to bail your boyfriend out of jail. Hey, you owe me big time, remember? Yeah, yeah. Jack! Brooke, how did you bail me out? My sister gave me her birthday money. Wait, where's your hair clip? Well, that was the deal. I gave her my hair clip, and she gave me her money. You did that for me? Brooke, I can't thank you enough. Well, hey, I don't need to use it with you, because I know you'll always be truthful with me. I promise you, I will. Let's play a game. Selected. Why would you do that? One of us is going to die now. Yes, but one of us is going to get money. What game are we playing? A game of odds. Heads or tails? Tails. All right, I choose heads then. No, it's tails. Uh, a redo? <sighs> Just the granola bar? Yes. How much? Let's play a game. Selected. What game? Go fish. The Ten of Hearts? Go fish. <sighs> Joker. What? How did you know? You're a cheater! Um, I'm home. Sissy, let's play a game. Selected. No, you can't say those words. Sissy, let's play a game. Selected. No, you can't say those words. One of us is going to die now. What game? What? You need to choose a game. You need to choose one you're good at. So that you can live. No, I don't want you to die. Sissy, just choose a game. Okay, how about we draw toothpicks? Whoever chooses the shortest stick loses. This is a game of luck. You're supposed to choose a game you're good at. I don't know what game I'm good at. You choose first. I got the short stick. Wait. Let's play a game. 
I want to make a deal with you. If I win the game, you spare my little sister. But if I lose, you kill us both and you get double the prize money. Deal. What game are we playing? Rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors. scissors. <sighs> another day, another charge. <clears throat> what? Mom, I need to borrow your charger. No, I'm using it. I'm only at 10%. I'm going to die. Here, hurry up. <clears throat> Let's try this. That's the emergency charger. This is an emergency. <clears throat> it didn't work. There must be something wrong with my charging port. Did I hear something wrong with the charging port? Hold still. Hold what? What happened? You made it worse. I'm at 2% now. There's one more thing we can try. Come with me. Wait. So, you need more charge? Yeah, my dad says you know what to do. <laughs> I have just the thing. Dad, this guy seems sketchy. Put this to your charging port, and whatever you do, don't move. Wait, why can't I move? No question, just do it. I am tired of getting electrocuted. Look at your energy. 200%? But that's not even possible. I have so much energy. I feel so great. My energy hasn't went down all day. Not even 1%. That's great, but maybe you should take a break, Brianna. Not a chance. Hi, Mom. Hi, Dad. I feel great. Are you sure? Oh, yes, I really do. My energy is at its max, and I am loving it. Woo! <laughs> Disappear and stay? What does this mean? It's a new form of population control. People can vote for you to disappear or stay. Why do you look worried? Well, Dad, because I haven't exactly been nice to people. Everyone's gonna vote for me to disappear. Oh, honey, it's going to be okay. Just try to apologize. Looks like it's finally payback time for you making fun of me all these years. I understand. I'm sorry. Hey, Giselle, remember that time you cut my ponytail off? Jessica, that was in middle school. Can't we just forget about that? Actually, we can't. You never even said you're sorry. I'm sorry. Giselle? Jake, hi. Remember that time you cheated on me? Look, I told you I was sorry. If I could take it back, I would. Well, you can't, so... Hey, um, Giselle? Look, just vote for me to disappear already. I never really liked you, but... Hey, uh, Giselle? Look, just vote for me to disappear already. I never really liked you, but... You voted for me to stay. Why? You're always mean to me, but I don't think anyone deserves to disappear. Thank you. I promise I'll try to change. Guys, look at him. He's such a loser. Hey, leave him alone. Look who's talking. You're a big bully yourself. Yeah, well, I'm trying to change. <laughs> you could never change. Shit, I forgot my pen. Hey, you could borrow mine. Wait, really? Thank you. You're welcome. Mom, I'm home. Do you have your report card? Yeah, it's right here. Look at this. You got all D's. You're such a disappointment. You don't mean that. Oh, yes, I do. I think it'll be better for you to just disappear. Mom, please don't. You don't really leave me much of a choice. Mom, I'm home. Do you have your report card? Yeah, it's right here. Look at this. You got all D's. You're such a disappointment. You don't mean that. Oh, yes, I do. And I think it'll be better if you just disappear. Mom, no, please don't. You don't really leave me much of a choice. What's going on here? Dad, Mom voted for me to disappear. Is this true? Yes, she's just a waste of space. You know what, Giselle, just come with me. Dad, what's going on? It's time I tell you the truth. She's not your real mom. Are you serious? Yes, I'm sorry. I never knew she would treat you like this. You lied to me my whole life. I only need one more vote to disappear, so I'm gonna go find someone to give me that. Hey, I know you hate me. Can you please just vote for me to disappear? Why would you want that? Look, just do it. Um, okay. Hey, I know you hate me. Can you please just vote for me to disappear? Why would you want that? Look, just do it. Um, okay. No, I said vote for me to disappear, not stay. But I did vote for you to disappear. What? 
You must be the one. The one? What do you mean, the one? I can't tell you here. Come with me. Can we stop running and you just tell me what's going on? There's a rumor that there's a person that's unable to disappear no matter how many votes they get. And I think it's you. <laughs> me? Why would it be me? Because when I voted for you to disappear, it went to stay. People are gonna come looking for you. You guys, there they are. They found us, we have to go. Okay, I think we're safe here. What are we gonna do? I haven't been completely honest with you. There isn't only one person I'm able to disappear. There's two, and I'm one of them. So you're one too? Yes, and here's what we need to do. Simon says everyone touched their nose. Hurry, everyone touched their nose. Everyone touched their head. Hurry up, everyone touched their head. No, they didn't say Simon says. Simon says, rip your test paper in half. Brianna, why did you rip your test? You won't be given another one. That's okay. I got a Simon says. Simon says, everyone stand still. Everyone start walking. Don't move, they didn't say Simon says. Simon says, start moving. These Simon says are getting worse and worse. I got a Simon says to break up with my boyfriend. That's awful. Simon says, kill your best friend. Your name is Simon? Are you the one running Simon says? I'm one of many. There's one of us in every school, every workplace, but you can't tell anyone about this. Why are you telling me all this? Because I think you're cute and I'd like to be in a relationship with you. Okay. Let's be in a relationship then. Great. Mom, I'm home. I had a really rough day. What are you doing? Put the gun away from your head. Simon says, let her do it. I got a Simon says to kill you, but I can't do it. I have to off myself instead. Mom! Simon, did you tell my mom to kill me? Simon says, don't reveal his identity. I only did it because I knew she wouldn't hurt you and would end up offing herself instead. What are you doing? Simon says, go to hell. Simon says, kill your best friend. What are you doing? God, as Simon says, I have no choice. I have to kill you. I got the same one. Look, we can find a way out of this. How can we get out of this? There is no way out. Simon says, don't blink. Oh no, I'm gonna blink. Simon says, once someone blinks, everyone will be able to blink again. Hey! No, please don't. She snapped fingers in my face. She cheated! I can't. I can't do this anymore. What's wrong? I don't even know who I am anymore. First, I kill my best friend. Then, I make someone lose and Simon says it. You're not a bad person. You can't blame yourself for what the game makes you do. You're nice. What's your name? It's Simon. Simon says, you are now Simon. I'm one of the controllers of the game now. All right, everyone, it's time to write the exam. Oh no, I forgot we had an exam today. Simon says cancel the exam. Uh oh, everyone, the exam's canceled today. Thank goodness the exam was canceled. I didn't study. One second, Kevin's coming. Hey, Bree. Hi, Kevin. Simon says compliment her dress. Well, Simon says, that's a really nice dress. Thanks, I got it from Halara. It's beautiful. Simon says, ask her out on a date. Another Simon says, will you go on a date with me? Of course, I'd love to. Hello. Who are you? I'm the creator of Simon Says. It's time. Time? It's time for you to kill someone. I know who you are. You're one of the controllers of Simon Says. <laughs> Why are you laughing? <laughs> you really are clueless, aren't you? I saw it sticking out of your pocket when you came to pick me up for our date. I assumed you weren't just happy to see me. When did you take the bullets out? When I gave you that big, long hug when you greeted me. How didn't I notice? Simon says, leave this town and never show your face here again. Uh, I gotta get out of here. Hi, young lady. Where are you walking all alone at night? Simon says, sew your mouth shut. No, I got a Simon says, I, I can't. Grandma, I'm home. I'm so proud of how tough you've become. I kind of like being Simon nowadays. But from now on, 
I want to be in charge. You'd really kill your own father? Ooh. Hey, you can't touch anything. Why not? You can only touch three things today. I don't understand what the big deal is. You have to save them in case of an emergency, okay? I'm sure it'll be fine. You can only touch your own body or things you're already wearing. I know. Everyone take out your textbooks and open to page three. I can't. You can't touch anything again today, Bailey? Just how it is, I'm sorry. You can follow along with what we're doing on the board. Hey, do you think you can hand me a pencil by any chance? No, uh, I'm sorry. Why not? I can see that you can touch three things. Just use one of them. No, I'm sorry. Just ask someone else. I want you to do it. Hey, what are you doing? Let go of me. Look, it's not that hard. Bitch, did you just slap me? Yes. You're gonna regret doing that. Reason? Reason of what? Sorry, I forgot to tell you. You have to pick the reason you die. I don't want to choose the reason that I die. You have to. We all do. Well, it's definitely not going to be by drowning. I'm going to pick the most painless one that I can. Good luck. I don't think any of the options are good. Murder? Oh my god, that's way worse. No. Can this give me an option that doesn't suck brutally? <laughs> Bailey! Oh, sis, what's wrong? I didn't pick a reason in time and it picked one for me. What? It picked one for you? Apparently you only get three choices. I didn't know that. I'm so scared to ever get into a car again. I'm so sorry. Be careful with your choices, okay? I will. Please just give me something painless. I don't remember anything that happened last night. Where am I right now? Welcome to your escape room. You must complete five tasks in order to leave. What? I don't want to play this game. You must play. Let me out of here. If you fail to complete all five tasks, you will not be making it out alive. What can you hold in your right hand but not your left? I don't know. My left hand. That wasn't so bad. <gasps> there is no way I am doing that. Please just let me out of here. Okay. That hurt. What now? How am I supposed to give myself a tattoo? No. I know you guys tell me to stop messing with my hair, but my bangs need a trim. Am I gonna go to a stylist? No. I'm gonna cut them myself with my baby tiny scissors. I just wanna do some baby pieces in the front because I don't trust myself, but I also can't see because of the bangs. Okay, I'm just gonna say fuck it and start cutting. <laughs> I don't wanna mess them up. That's my biggest worry that they're just gonna like look really bad. I don't think that that's even. I think I need to cut a little bit more on this side. Hopefully I won't <laughs> regret this. Okay, I'm too scared and I barely took anything off, but I can definitely see now, which is good. I think that they're cute. My hair is always really messy, so you probably won't even tell if they're kind of uneven. Okay guys, I just got back from the festival day two and my hair is looking a little crazy, but the makeup has stayed on for the entire duration of the festival because of this NYX Cosmetics mattifying setting spray. It is so impressive and look at these stars. The dating standards in 2023 are literally on the floor. Like when did a date become getting in a car and just sitting in the parking lot? I just want someone to serenade me. Is that too much to ask? If you agree that romance is dead, then you're gonna like this song. I keep So, how many do you have? One. Oh, I'm so sorry, sweetie. I'm sure it'll be better next year. Hey, girl, any luck this year? It's okay. I'll be here for you. Come on, let's get to class. Oh, look, it's the loser that never talks. Any words this year? I'll take that as a no. Oh, shut up, Olivia. Excuse me? Oh look, the mute is all alone. No one to stand up for her this time. What's that? Did you want to say something? I thought so. Oh honey, you're home. Did you have a good day at school? Do you want to talk about it? 
Oh, no, sorry, sweetie. I didn't mean... I can finally speak. Morning, honey. Good morning, mom. You're talking. I'll tell you all about it later. I'm going to school. Guess what? Wait, how are you talking? The system offered me to steal Olivia's words. Giselle, that's a criminal offense. Wait, what? Yeah, they can lock you up for it. I had no idea. I'm gonna get into so much trouble. How does she even have infinite words? Hey, is it possible for somebody to have infinite words? Infinite words? No way. Well, Olivia did. Now I have them. Giselle, please report to the principal's office immediately. They know. Giselle, please report to the principal's office immediately. They know. Just relax, you don't know that. Go in there and act like you know nothing. I'll try. You can do this. To see me, Mr. Fitz? Yes, hi. I presume you know about Olivia's words? Yeah, I may have heard about it. Do you have any idea who might have stolen them? No, I have no idea. If you're lying to me, you're going to be in big trouble. I promise, I don't know anything. Okay then, be sure to let me know if you do. I will. What am I going to do though? I'm going to find out I'm lying and... Giselle? Olivia? I should have known it was you. No, no, this is all a big misunderstanding. Save it. You're going to be locked up for a long time. Wait. If I have your words, how are you talking? That doesn't concern you now, does it? The only important thing here is I found out who stole them. No, please, I can explain. Giselle, Olivia, come with me. Giselle, Olivia, come with me. I'm sorry, but who are you? I'm here regarding Olivia's words. We're going to sort this out. Okay. Where are we? Leave the questions to me. Did you or did you not steal Olivia's words? Well, yes I did, but it's not my fault. Stop lying. She did steal them. You better start telling the truth. How did you take them? The system offered me to steal them. That's impossible. I promise you I'm telling the truth. How many words did you steal? It says she had infinite. Well, that's impossible. Unless she's been stealing yours. Wait. So she's been stealing my words all along? Of course I have. And I would have gotten away with it too, if it wasn't for you. I can't believe this. I'm so sorry about the confusion, miss. It's okay, at least she's locked up now. We have taken away all of her words and given them back to you. Thank you. Hey, Mommy, can I ride the bus to school with my friends? No, honey, I'll walk you. Okay. Hey, Mom, can I go to the mall with Jessica? Her mom's taking us. You can go, but I'm driving you. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Hey, Mom, there's this school trip. Can I go? How long is the drive? About three hours. No, sorry, you can't go. Okay. Hey, Mom, I'm finally 16. Can I please learn how to drive? No. But both my sisters got to learn at my age. I said no. This is not fair. Hey, girl, are you coming with us to Jackson's party tonight? I would love to, but I can. Ugh, is this about the whole driving thing? I'll take you. I have my license. You know what? Yeah. Pick me up at seven. I'll follow you into the park Through the jungle, through the dark Girl, I've never loved one like you Boats and boats and waterfalls Alleyways and payphone calls I've been everywhere with you That's true We laugh until we think we'll die But if I on a summer night Nothing new be sweeter than it is to run free like it's only you and me Jeez, you're something to see Oh, home, let come home Home is wherever I'm with you Oh, home, let come home Home is wherever I'm with you
You can only say yes. Yes. Sweetie, does this dress make me look fat? Yes. You really think that? Yes. You're such a disappointment. Do you know that? Yes. Giselle, will you do today's homework for me? Yes. Really? I wasn't expecting you to say yes. Will you do the whole week's homework for me? Yes. Oh my gosh, thanks. You're the best. Yes. Class, today we're doing a pop quiz. Yes. Giselle, you seem really excited about the quiz. Yes. Should we throw in a surprise presentation too? She better say no. If she says yes, she's done. Yes. Hey, babe, I think we should break up. Yes. Wait, so you want to break up too? Yes. You're cheating on me, aren't you? Yes. You can only say no. No. Honey, do you want some breakfast? No. But it's your favorite, chocolate chip pancakes. No. Are you okay? Should I call a doctor? No. Giselle, did you finish the assignment? No. Are you planning to finish it? No. And you just earned yourself detention? No. That's it. Go to the principal's office. Giselle, do you have a day to prom yet? No. I heard Chad's going to ask you. No. But I thought you were in love with Chad. <gasps> Giselle, he's coming. No, 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 no. Hey, Giselle. Will you go to prom with me? No. Is that a yes or a no? No. Whatever. I'm out of here. No. It's what my dad would want. You picked the prince, right? Of course. Good, because I'm not having you marry a pirate. They can't be trusted. Dad was a pirate, and you married him. We don't speak of your father. You know that. Marianne, why do you have the pirate's mark? I don't know. Girl, don't lie to me. All right, fine, I picked the pirate, but I don't know why everyone is so afraid of them. They seem kind of cool. I don't think I can be friends with you. Why? Why? Because I'm not going to be associated with someone who wants to marry a pirate. They're dangerous, and now that you have that mark, they're going to come for you. Mom, I'm home. Mom? Hello. We're looking for a girl with the pirate's mark. Take off that cloak. We're looking for a girl with the pirate's mark. Take off that cloak. I don't think that's... The captain wasn't asking. I knew it. I could sense her mark. Take her to the ship, boys. Yes, Captain. Wait, what? Welcome aboard the ship, the Blue Pearl. Legend says when you touch your soulmate, your mark will disappear. So let's see which one of us gets to marry you. Raise your sword if you think the girl is your soulmate. All right, make a line. Hello, miss. Let's see if it's me. <sighs> but that's all of us. What about him? Father, do you think I could try? I told you to stay below deck. Ignore my son. He's no pirate. Wait, where'd you get that necklace? My father. Captain, doesn't that look just like the one that the, the Pirate King had? Tell me, what is your father's name? You know what? I can already tell you're his daughter, which means you're the lost pirate princess. I can already tell you're his daughter, which means you're the lost pirate princess. My father was a pirate, but he wasn't a king. Why do you speak of him in past tense? Because he's dead. Who told you that? My mother. I see. So she was the sea witch who took you away. Don't call her that. She said she wanted to protect me from him. No, your father wanted you to have a royal life. And she wanted you to have a normal one. At least that's what he told me. Wait a minute, you knew my father? Yes, we were great friends. Why don't I take you to him? You would do that? Of course. After all, you are royal blood. Princess, you have to get off the ship. Right now. What? Why? Because my father lied to you. He's not taking you to see your father, him, and all the other crewmates. They're cursed. The only way to break the curse is to sacrifice a royal. He wants to kill me. I want to help you, but we have to jump off the ship. Your mark, it's gone. That means I'm your... Well, soulmates. I don't even know your name. Oh, right. My name is William. I have a canoe we can escape Not in. so fast. You take my son. I'll take the girl. No! William. Where are we? We're on Skull Island, Princess. In the exact spot we were all cursed. 
How much of my blood do you need? To break the curse, we need all of it. Father, no! You stay away from my daughter. Dad? I told you he was alive. Take all of his crewmates into custody. Turn around. Wait, I was trying to help her! No, wait. Spare him, please. That's my soulmate. Gods, leave him. Yes, your majesty. Dad, I thought that you were dead. How did you find me? I gave you that necklace for a reason, love. It's a tracker. I see you chose to remain a princess. Well, Marianne, would you still like to marry a pirate? Yes. How would you like to be married? 